Alright guys, today we are stepping beyond Windows and into Android as we look at a fake antivirus. And as you can see, it's delivered by this advertisement that says uh, there's like 124,000 threats for Android and I need to download and scan for free. So we will download this package here. It is downloading and it is giving us instructions for installing applications from unknown sources. Uh, I think I already have that set up. So we can just go ahead and install this APK here. And it wants to access quite a few things, which is not a problem for me. We'll go ahead and install. And Armor for Android is now on our test device here. There's the boot screen or whatever. And it's telling us about some other features. Sort of similar to fake antiviruses on Windows. We've got uh, all kinds of crap. A task killer, a speed booster, a cloud backup beta. But let's just take a look at the antivirus. Because this is what matters. And we got a big red per or deep scan button. And as soon as we try to do that, it asks us for credit card info, just like on Windows. Except this time it's only $1.99 instead. <clears throat> instead of $99.90 or something crazy like that. And we have some extra features of the program. Not a big deal. We'll go back. And we've got some settings here, real-time scanning, notifications, all that good stuff. Security tab does nothing. Privacy, well, this is interesting, um, you can clear different things. Gmail, call logs, clipboard, I guess we have to select something. Clear now, and there it goes, I guess it cleared it, I'm not really sure. And I'm not going to check it. So we'll go to the More tab, and it bugs me to buy the program. So we'll go back. We have an account, apparently. And I'm using the free version of Armor for Android. This camera is not the best, but it'll do. This is just uh, Terms of Service. Nothing special here. And something else that I didn't notice earlier, Armor for Android starts a quick scan whenever you run it, which I suppose is interesting. And let's just go ahead and remove it. It's just the uh, APK on here, so there's no Trojan element getting your root and all that. So all we have to do is uninstall it, but I'm just going to use it fast, because why not? So we'll go ahead and open a vast. Just agree to all that crap. Uh, something going on over there. So we'll go ahead and go to virus scanner. And we'll scan now. It automatically updates so you don't have to worry about all that. And it has found one problem, a potentially unwanted program, Armor for Android. And we will just go ahead and resolve this issue. You can just uninstall it like that or just hit the big resolve all button, yes, okay. And it's done. And it's gone. And that will wrap it up for Armor for Android. Uh, hopefully I can test more Android malware in the future if there's any that's actually visually interesting. Most of them are just stealth Trojan type things. So 
Thank you very much for watching.